So when someone goes to an event, once they find one that they're interested in, how can they get the best out of or get the most out of going to the event? Do you have any you know tips and things that people can do to make sure they're getting their money's worth? I think it's important to be active in socializing and trying to talk to as many people as possible, trying not to be shy if you're normally shy and uh, yeah, try to start conversation. It's also important to take notes. So I had a friend who would go to a conference and she would take pictures with uh, each person she talks because, you know, after you talk with even like just eight yeah. people in the day, you forgot like the first person's name. So it's important to exchange cards or take a picture of a uh, name tag, which is hanging on the neck. And uh, if you can, like, you know, go aside and put in your phone, uh, you know, some notes. Okay, I talked to Todd. He's from uh, uh, Florida and he knows about this and that. He does this and that. So later it will be much easier for you to remember who is who. Sometimes it's also good to get in contact with organizers, you know, to come and uh, and talk to them how they do so that you get a feeling what kind of people are behind this event. And uh, if you talk in person, you get more understanding of why they do this event so you get maybe big appreciation f f if you are in doubt you know if you also if you don't like something in the event go to the organizers and uh, tell them sometimes maybe in the room is too cold and nobody's saying and then it will steep co uh, stay cold or other things which can improve organizers work uh, ne for the next event and in our events personally we got all the feedback we have like team members we have a google doc shared among team members and whoever talks to somebody heard some feedback from a seller at the dinner or at a random place they later go back go to this google doc and type uh, you know whatever feedback they got uh, let's say somebody said it's too many presentations would be nice more socializing sponsor said they need more time it would be nice longer breaks so all these details we consider very very strongly as organizers for the next event and we're always always adjusting according to that so um yeah so this is how i would suggest for attendees to be active in the events yeah i think that's good for sure to talk to the event organizers telling them what you liked and didn't like i think a lot of times in life we just assume that somebody else will say something if yeah. the room is cold or something exactly um and for the most part probably everybody else is thinking like you are oh somebody else will say something so step mm -hmm. up and be the person who you know talks about what you liked what you didn't like um, you know, that's one reason I always answer those Amazon seller polls and seller central and type in my mm -hmm. comments and everything, you know, a lot of people are afraid to do that for whatever reason, but you know, if you don't tell them what's going on, what you think, they don't know. Yeah. It takes extra effort, but it's just a few minutes afterwards. Yeah, for sure. So networking, super important, get out of your shell, force yourself. Um, you know, I'm an introvert. I used to be super shy, but I forced myself to just do some things that don't feel comfortable. It only feels uncomfortable for a short period. And mm. odds are pretty good that that other person, you're at the same conference, you probably have a lot in common and a lot that you can talk about. Um, and then taking notes, like you said, is super important. But even more important, I think, is taking notes and then picking one or two things that you're going to take action on after the event. Because a lot of yeah. times you go home with a notebook full of notes and then mm. you never do anything. So you just got to pick one or two things to actually so, yeah. implement. 